open as, as human beings to evidence. So if you started to see people around you, or, or here even, that oh, so-and-so had the flu or a cold or this and this and this, and it's spreading, it's catching, and so on and so forth. Uh, it's, it's part of, uh, like we have the acronym for fear, false evidence appearing real. Uh, all forms of sickness uh, have the origin and the belief and the possibility of sickness. And the possibility of sickness goes back to this idea that we could be separate from our source. I mean, if, if our source is love and joy and happiness, why would that love and joy and happiness even create sickness? I mean, what, what would be the point, you know, in the, all the glory of the kingdom of heaven or nirvana to just say, oh yeah, let's throw in a little sickness into the mix, you know, here. It's, you know, it's so happy, but let's get a little contrast. It doesn't make any sense. So I think most people at a deep core level kind of have an idea that there's probably some kind of trick going on with sickness. And what you're describing is the evidence. Uh, if you look at, at, we'll say, 15 or 20 people getting sick, that's, that's even kind of a small sample compared to, we'll say, like epidemics, like with cholera or something, you know, that, you know, that seems to be a huge ep epidemic. Um, or let's look at, at this idea of, of separation and conflict and even war. If you just look at human history, there's been so many wars and so many conflicts. Whether they're physical conflicts between people and countries or psychological conflicts. So this world is, is a projection of an insane idea projected outward as if, as if insanity is real. And what you're describing is, is an, a sample or an example of something. And the only way I think that we can fully release this uh, mesmerism or this suggestion uh, that seems to have turned into the medical model. <laughs> it started off as a, as a little suggestion and all of a sudden now we've got the medical model with all over the world and doctors and it's like medicines and it's gone you know, it's, a, it's one tiny little suggestion that's kind of exploded and, and seemed to take on a reality. But when you start to realize the power of mind, the power of thought, and you start opening to the witnesses of that, which can come through books and authors and, I mean, even, uh, I think of Wayne Dyer, he's living right here in Hawaii, and he just went through recently a, a healing cancer and John of God involved in, in beautiful, beautiful symbol. But we start to draw in witnesses like Wayne telling his story of healing and so forth. And it starts to turn our mind to, oh yeah, intuitively I know that I have the power inside of me to be healed and healthy and well, to be peaceful, joyful, happy. And we also recognize that there will be temptations and witnesses to the ego's belief system in sickness and separation. And those are just our opportunities to forgive. Even when it seems to be a mass outbreak. Even when it seems to be a war breaking out. And, and we're tempted when the, the rockets are firing, we're watching on nightly news and scud missiles are going and so on and so forth. We still have to come back to our practice of, you know, I could see peace instead of this. There is a, another way of looking at this world. And, and I, for me, it always just made me stronger. It, it threw me inside my mind even stronger to, to find that place of peace and to see the world differently. And to me, it's realistic. I mean, I, once I started experiencing lots of miracles and more and more, it started to get convincing. Like, okay, I really have not seen this world as it truly is. I was more than willing to say, I hope I've been wrong about this because I don't like the way that I feel. I was more than willing to say, show me, show me, you lead the way, turn, turn me around, point me in the right direction, show me some evidence and some symbols that will help me strengthen my experience of this. So that's what it's been for me, it's, that's how it turns around. <laughs>